What is going on guys, this is Ben here, so in today's video, we are going to be hunting for some legendaries on the Benton 1 noob account. We took a little bit of a step back, actually we'll say this, a big step back from where we were the other day. We were at 300, or 3,771 trophies, and now we are actually at 3586. So, a little bit of a step back, but hey, it's a process. I am going to be on the hunt for some legendaries. Well, actually, only one. I want the Night Witch so I can run a Golem Battle deck. I actually did record a video opening some Super Magicals, and I got the Bandit and the Log in it back to back to back. But I didn't hit the record button, so we're playing the mistake. But hey, we got the Bandit as well, which is a really awesome card. I don't. The Battle deck that I'm running right now actually doesn't have it in there. I'm just kind of doing like a giant graveyard, seeing how this is playing out. The main one that I want to use is this one right here. But I want the Night Witch first because I would switch the Knight with the Night Witch and it would actually make the battle deck a lot better. Um, so hunting for that today should be fun. We have also our free chest to open. I might as well, dude. I might as well just open up these down here too. But might as well, let's get to a battle. So definitely like if you guys are hyped and want me and want me and want me to get this thing to 4,000, this account. It's gonna be a tough, tough run, but as the season progresses, it should be easier because then I won't face as many level 11s that have level 12 or level 13 cards, dude. It's like, come on. I faced uh, today alone, because I did a lot of matches today. Today alone, I faced one level 13 barbarian, elite barbarians, and then like five or six, I think, people that have like level 12 cards. So it's a little bit of a struggle. Uh, <laughs> But it, I think we can do it. I definitely think we can. We just need our, our nice, just basically lock in on a deck that we want to use and we should be okay. Uh, hopefully we don't run into an Inferno Tower this match though. Uh, other than that though, I'm curious to hear like any goals that you guys have for Clash Royale right now. Like whether it be a new trophy high, getting a specific card. So basically I have two goals. Like getting the Night Witch, obviously, because it's such a powerful card. And getting, dude, my nose really itches. I'm not picking it, but dude, like... It just had like, it felt like there's like, I don't even know. Sometimes you just get like those little itches, man. It happens. Um, but yeah, so then my other one is getting 4,000 trophies. So those are my goals. What are you guys' goals for Clash Royale at this moment in time? And then tomorrow, you guys are going to see a video on the 2v2 Sudden Death Draft Challenge. Now that is going to be really, really hard, I think. Because 2v2 coordination with a random person is hard enough as it is. And it being Sudden Death is even going to make it much, much harder due to the fact that like... You can't, you can't mess up, otherwise if you lose your tower, you're done. Like, if this was sudden death right now in that challenge, the game would be over. Because I lost my tower first. Uh, I'm going to graveyard on this, why not? He has the princess. I, I wish I had enough for my aerial, arrows, man. I'm still going to drop them. Um, I know they're a little bit late, but yeah, we got good damage. Well, yes, it's it. Oh, they even took it? I was not expecting to take that tower whatsoever. I had a little bit of a... That wasn't even a voice crack. It was just like my voice going out, man. Jeez, I hit like puberty probably... I don't know. I, I, I hit puberty really, really early on compared to a lot, of, like, a lot of other people in high school. I was one of the early puberty bloomers, I guess. <laughs> and I had this I had this beast of a facial hair. It wasn't, it wasn't on point as it is right now, but I've had it since I was really, really... Uh, I would say... 15 it started coming in nice and flush um and i'm really glad because dude i was always envious of people older people like older men or whatever that had like just luscious beards and i've always wanted them so i'm glad i got blessed with the nice facial hair the facial hair gene or whatever <laughs> um other than that i don't even remember what i was talking about i just got put on the face that's why you guys are like all my videos typically have like me with a beard I don't, I love, I just, I just love beards, dude. I don't know. It's not, it's not, it's not like an obsession. It's just like, I just think they look so cool. And I know maybe some people think they look, they look scrappy or unprofessional. I don't know. We're just on this beard talk. But let me know, what's your personal opinion on the beards? But it's just so nice because it used to be so patchy. Like you see on the, like on the sides, like the handlebars kind of, I, it took forever for that part to come in. But I've always had like, a beast amount of hair over here and stuff but yeah that's my facial hair thing you see how excited i get just talking about it dude i don't know i just think they look amazing and i don't know i don't think i, I don't think i'll ever not have facial hair anymore unless like for whatever reason it just i, I mess up <laughs> like i mess up trimming it somehow and it's like oh i gotta take this all off but other than that we'll open up some super magicals oh yeah i forgot about this we hopefully get enough 
gold so we can unlock the graveyard. I think I'm going to just get the gold right now. Boom. And I'll most likely get more gems so I can open up like three uh, super magicals. All right. So I need, mm, I need another one of these and this. Get that 120k. Boom. So we got three graveyards. I don't know if that was really... Well, I'm using the graveyard right now, so I'm going to upgrade it. <laughs> Jeez, this is just getting gold right now. We're on the legendary hunt, and we're just getting gold. Um, What is it, 20k I need? So let's do this. Two, three, four. See, uh, I'll just save that. I'm going to get that in a match or two, so I'll upgrade the graveyard eventually. We'll open up our first super magical. I'll get more gems if we get a legendary here. Come on. No. I'll still get more. I'll still get more for guys. Oh, did we get arrows? Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Because now this is a must upgrade because my arrows do not kill. Level 12. Minion horde. So frustrating. And I can also upgrade the skeleton army. Oh, I just kind of... I think I just screwed up, guys. Well, let's, do, well, let's go upgrades this first round. Boom. And then I'll open up some more super magicals in a little bit. But hey. We upgraded our graveyard. Solid. We didn't get a well, we didn't get like the night wish yet, but the graveyard is the main push that I want. Uh, this video is also sponsored by Festival Water. Go to your local festival and pick up their waters. They're really, really good. I'm not paid to. It's not sponsored at all, guys. <laughs> old joke. I know I've explained that not too long ago, so I'm not gonna explain it again. But old stream joke, we'll say. Back when I actually was, on, I used to stream on Twitch. A long time ago, and I bet you some of you don't even know what I was streaming back then. It was it was Clash Royale. No, not Clash Royale. <laughs> Clash of Clans. Sorry. Base designs, and then I would do base reviews. Oh my goodness, that was that. Those bring me back. Uh, I guess we're gonna fireball. I mean, that's all I really got. Leap Barbarians level 12. What's up? How you doing? I'm telling you, we face them all the time, man. Uh, we'll just reset here, get some elixir. We know he has that Inferno Dragon. That's going to be a pain in the butt to deal with. Leap Barbarians, Fire Spirits, and I wasn't really paying attention to the other cards. Um, I don't know. I guess we'll find out. I'm assuming either a Valkyrie. Okay, the Knight. I think that was the other one. This guy might have a Valkyrie, which is a great counter to my graveyard. And the majority of people actually do run the Valkyrie right now. It's kind of annoying. And fireball. All right. Oof. Now that one hurts. Not having my musketeer high enough level to survive a fireball. Ah, that's a little rough. We're gonna have to. Oh, he's got the zap too. Oh my goodness, guys. This guy's got all the counters for me. I I don't know if we're gonna be able to pull this one out. Maybe if we can make some miraculous push. But I'm gonna have to like fireball this Inferno Dragon, otherwise it probably would kill me. I don't know. I don't know. Two towers taking a level one Inferno Dragon. I think the fireball was not necessary. But I'm gonna see what side he pushes. Okay. Just for all we know so far, he's not going for a three crown. That could change. He has the Ice Wizard. I don't want to drop the Musketeer because he's just gonna fireball it. That was supposed to be a Musketeer drop, actually. <laughs> see. Oh my God. Yeah. This is this is GG probably. Just throwing that fireball on the freaking musketeer, man. Get out of here, bro. We'll double giant it up here. And I do not actually have enough for another mega minion. We'll probably get fireballed. Oh, that's so frustrating. I need a zap in here. I think I might put a zap because Inferno Tower basically kills me. But, dude, it's just like. Mike. Mike. From you to me, we'll give you this one. You got this one, Mike. You got the zaps. You got it all. But even if I had a zap, I don't think there was any way. So we'll, we'll do the, we'll give him the, the pride salute. I don't even, I don't even know. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying right now. Oh, all right, we're gonna get more gems, open up some more chests, and hopefully get that night witch. All right, we're getting into it. No legendary spam. <laughs> The video or the me opening three in a row off well it was supposed to be recorded but it was technically off recorded and now it's two legendaries in a row like what is this luck on camera guys off camera it seems as though I can open up legendaries like that doesn't even matter 
but uh, but on camera. You guys are bad luck. What the heck, man? You guys got to wish. Wish that every time I open up a Super Magical, I get a Legendary. That's how, we're, that's how we run down here. A level 9, okay. I'm used to facing only level 10s and level 11s. So props to this guy. Oh, never mind, not props. He's got level, <laughs> level 12 <laughs> Barbarians. So this guy probably just has one battle deck that he runs and only requests those cards and upgrades those cards. That's why he's a level 9. So I have no shame if I beat this level 9 because it's not even like he's under leveled. He's on par and more upgraded than me on cards. The only thing is, that's different is tower. But his cards are a lot stronger as we can see. Level freaking 12 Elite Barbarians again. The one card that's so annoying to deal with. Did I even get my graveyard off last game? I'm just thinking about that. I don't think I ever dropped the graveyard, guys. Uh, nah, I'll just let my elixir stack back up here. Prepare for another. Oh, man. This is tough. I have to drop this. The wizards. Double whiz. What up? Uh, I'm hope I'm pro probably going to see Elite Barbarians dropped here, right? I assume we would. I guess defensive giant don't really want to have to, but hey, at least he wasted the log. Um, he's got to be low on elixir, so I'm gonna do a graveyard push here, and then I'll have a fireball and arrows ready just in case. So ice wizard, all right. What are you gonna drop, man? Skeleton army. This fireball is probably a little bit overkill. Could have just arrowed. I didn't expect the ice wizard to go on as fast as it did. Took the tower. That level 3 graveyard, man. Oh. Want other legendaries, to be honest. Start on the skeleton arm because it's not even going to be that great to, to stop his elite barbarians, man. It's, it really isn't because he has the wizard. And he's he's gearing up for another, another elite barbarian level 12 rush. Whew. Whew. We got to be ready. I really want a fireball right now, dude. <laughs> Okay, we got the fireball. Prepare for the. We're gonna predict the elite barbarian drop. Hmm. He did not drop the elite barbarians. I thought he was gonna throw it in there, and just try and muster his way through there. And this definitely requires an arrow. So this is elite barbarians, though. Put on Askelis. Uh, I don't think he's gonna take the tower. We have enough defensive things, but he did get a little bit of good chip damage. So we'll just wait till ten elixir right now. And then if we need to, we'll do a graveyard um, giant push. I think we'll do it. Why not? All right, we should take his tower. Just he's he's either has to go for my tower or play defense, and he can't do both to get him in tower range. So good game, dude. We survived. Like I said, no no sorrow, no compassion, or no sympathy. I, I guess is the best word <laughs> for that level nine. So yeah, we're actually gonna open up the last super magical chest and wrap up the video. Just a short one here, guys. I gotta head out. But man, no legendaries out of the super magical. That's sad. The worst look ever. Three off camera on the accidental whatever, and then <laughs> zero. <laughs> Big fat zero when opening these ones. So that sucks. I'm really bummed out about that one. But hey, at least we upgraded stuff. That was probably my worst chest opening for Super Magicals ever. Ever. And it's not like... And I have a high percentage of getting legendaries, dude. Because I can unlock any of them. Well, that's really a bummer. That's a buzzkill. So I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry you guys had to struggle through that one. Oh, that one hurts a little bit. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you did, and it was subscribe for more Clash Royale videos, and I'll see you guys later.